I'm Corporal Remington Hall, and this is The Core Report. This week we start off our show with not one badass, but two. Petty Officer 2nd Class Alejandro Salabaria was awarded the Silver Star for actions as a corpsman with Marine Special Operations Command during Operation Enduring Freedom in 2014. Salabaria advanced to an injured corpsman in the middle of a firefight and literally covered him while returning fire until the shooting stopped. And Staff Sergeant Nathan Hervey was awarded the Bronze Star with Valor for actions as a scout sniper during Operation Enduring Freedom in 2011. Hervey's squad was caught in a firefight while performing surveillance in Helmand Province. He led his snipers through dangerous territory to an advantageous firing position and suppressed the enemy until reinforcements arrived. Hoorah, gentlemen. The CH-53K King Stallion is currently undergoing developmental testing and is scheduled to join the Fleet Marine Force in 2019. The King Stallion is set to replace the CH-53E Super Stallion. Although they look the same, the King Stallion's larger frame allows it to internally carry a Humvee and its new triple turbine engines boast 50% more power than the Echo, giving it a top speed of 200 knots and allowing it to carry more weight than a semi-truck. There's been a steady increase in the number of reported cases of the Zika virus. The medical officer of the Marine Corps has advice on protective measures. Marines, the Zika virus is an emerging threat. Those who plan to travel to affected areas need to be aware of its risks and the protective measures. These precautions are especially important to those who are pregnant or may become pregnant. Your health is our mission. Semper Fidelis. Be sure to watch the full video at the link in the description. There's more to it than just changing your socks and taking Motrin. Commandant of the Marine Corps General Robert Neller has issued an update to the promotion requirements. Now instead of 8 months time in grade within quarter for Lance Corporal to Corporal and 12 months time in grade within quarter for Corporal to Sergeants, it's 12 months time in grade regardless of quarter for both. I wouldn't advise using those extra few months to keep procrastinating Corporal's course. That's all for this week. Thanks for watching everyone and we'll see you next payday right here on the Core Report.